Welcome everyone to today's video. Today I'm taking you thrifting. It's been a while since we went to a lot of clothing based stores and I don't really know how many stores I'm gonna go to today because if I'm being honest the main reason that I'm going thrifting today is that we want to get Teddy Boy used to other people like his dad obviously works a lot more than I am or I'm like working from home which means that today I decided to just leave the house for a couple of hours for them to be by themselves so I decided to come here thrifting it's this weird building but it is in here I took you here before I love that they added a boat I don't know it's kind of fun they have a really highly curated section but also a random section they also do have some home decor so let's go in there and see what they have however before we go in let's do a little parking lot fit check so they used to have a different location and the funny thing is that this was one of the places that truly made me fall in love with thrifting and I feel like the sole reason for that is because they used to always have like the most extra pieces and so I'm really excited they then moved here to this huge building however it's only one floor so let's go and see if we can find some amazing pieces today As said, they also have a decor section, so let's start here. This is pretty cool, but it's also 22 bucks, so. I feel like I've been finding so many of these 90s, 2000s, dust, 70s Penny Lane kind of coats. You can always tell by the tag, but this one is in really nice condition. In case you ever wondered who was like the German 60s, 70s musical it girl, it's her, Katja Epstein. I personally don't really like the music, but the pictures are pretty good. Like this dress, I love this one. Also this look very Jane Birkin-esque. I feel like this shoe was here the last time that I was here because it's a size too small and I'm pretty sure I've seen it before and I was like, I'm definitely gonna buy it, but it's not my size. So beautiful though. These are also kind of cool. I have made it to the far back of the store, which is where they have their 50s, 60s, and 70s things. It's all of that. So let's take a look. I love how sometimes when you go thrifting, you come back a year later and you can kind of check on some things because I swear this has been here forever. This 70s style jumper is pretty cute. Look at this, this is a kid's blouse. It is so 70s. I'm kind of wondering whether I should start collecting pieces like this for Teddy Boy, but then I don't want to force him to wear something if he doesn't like it. But this would be so cute, look at the collar. I do not know about the size of this, but I need to try it. It's a 70s corduroy suit. How good would this be if this would actually fit me? I need to try this on. This is such a cool dress, but I feel like it would once again just be a weird length on me. Yeah, if I go further back there, I'm entering the 80s, which I'm not looking for. But I know that they have glasses and I need to get my eyes checked really badly. I'm sure I need new glasses. So currently I'm looking for a vintage frame that I can then 
put my prescribed lenses in. So let's see if they have any pieces that I really like today. Made it to the dressing room with a cart full of things that we can now try on together. I'm so excited. Let's see. I'm most excited for the 70s suit. So let's start with this one. A little part of me was maybe hoping that this one fit me because it is over 50 bucks. But I think it fits me really well. There is no more in here. Let's go outside and check this. I'm so excited right now. I am a little unsure if I'm being fully honest. Just because of the way that it like hits my waist. I don't know. My hips. Is this good or is it not? I, I, I need a second to figure this out. Another dressing room just free up, so I think that's better because it has a full length mirror. Do I like these pants? Is the one question now because I don't like these little like darts. I'm so unsure about this piece. Let me show you the jacket with it again. I think the reason why I'm so unsure here is because I feel like I'm missing a great opportunity if I don't get it. But then the other thing is, will I actually wear it if I get it? Oh, it is so cool. I feel like Francois Hardy, but it is a little big. Like overall, it's just, I feel like it needed a few inches less. And then on, on the shoulder, it's fitting fine. Just don't know about the waist and the hips, if I'm being honest. Cause I feel like- Here comes the fashion analysis. I don't like this, if that makes sense. I don't know if it's my hips, if it's a jacket, I'm so unsure. But maybe that's the sign that I shouldn't get it, but look at the car. What do I do? I need help. <laughs> what do we think about this skirt? I love the texture and the dark green blue color. Can I style this in like a really cool Stevie kind of look? Because I really like it. It is knitted. It's kind of heavy. I do like it. It is very comfortable too. This is definitely an option. No, but why is this the cutest little Christmas look? <laughs> um, the skirt, I like. It would just need to be kind of like this, I guess. Yeah, that's like a length that I can do. But that's actually an easy fix. And I'm kind of looking for like some skirts with structure because I feel like I have a lot of like basic colored skirts. And then the jacket, I'm so unsure. Because I don't know about like the shoulders. I think that this is too big on me. I think it's supposed to be smaller. Hello. So I'm not sure about this part. Sometimes I question myself because I really looked at this and I thought it might fit. <laughs> it doesn't, but it's a nice jacket anyway. We went through the time changes with like where you turn the clock and so now it is like 4 p.m. but completely dark out. So I feel like this is the best opportunity to show you what I'm wearing today. I kind of currently really like to have my shirt outside of the skirt. It's like a very Shantate-esque look. I like it. It makes the skirt look even more micro mini. Oh, I choose this and then this jacket. It's actually a rain jacket. It's not that cold today, so I really like it. And the color of this is also to die for. And then purple tights because um, still have the tendonitis, and so I figured it would match the cast. I also picked up this fabric because I really like the print, but I don't like how it feels. It's like very stiff. I wanted to use this to make some cushion in our kitchen, but I don't think the colors will work. So I'm gonna put that back, and I feel like these are the two pieces I'm gonna get. My camera is in night mode. It looks so much brighter on screen than it is in real life. The sun is definitely setting. Um, I hope the traffic is gonna go by fast because I really want to check out another store. There is this other store they sell the most <laughs> random selection of things, but I really want to check in just because I'm already in the area. It's like a 10 minute drive. So I would love, love, love for that to work out, but that depends on the traffic. Because I do really want to go home to my baby too. I've only been away for like one and a half hours. But it breaks my heart, honestly. I need to be occupied doing something. Otherwise, I would think about them. And my boyfriend keeps sending me pictures, so that doesn't help. But I'm happy to just see that they're doing fine, which I knew that that was going to happen. But I feel like it's just nice to be reassured that everything is fine. So, yeah. 
Oh, was I out of focus for this entire speech? I am sorry. Um, it doesn't really matter. I'm on the way to the next store. We made it to the next store. This is a true and drive treasure chest. So let's see. They always have this wagon out front with the most random things. I made my way to the back of the store and I picked up four things so far. Let me quickly show you those. First up, I'm a sucker for a good pod. Look at this. It's so good. I love the shape. I found two pieces of clothing that I like. I just quickly throw those on on top of my clothing. So I really hope that they fit. These beigey pants that I really, really like actually. And then this really cool like turtleneck sweater with these stripes. And then I found something that I'm pretty sure is actually a camera bag. But I love these kind of like square bags. So I'm just gonna use this as a purse. And I usually like bring a camera. So I feel like this will be great. One thing that I'm looking for are mugs in general and Christmassy mugs. Because, as said, there's a giveaway coming. Might be related to that, at least on my end. But I'm really excited, so let's look at the dishware. These little mugs are so cute. These are so cool too. I always just have the issue that they're so small. I just like my coffee from like a bigger mug. But maybe I just need to find some small ones that I like. I do love this mug and it has a decent size, so this is a keeper. What is this? What is it for? It's cute, but what do I do with it? Look at these. Oh, I need to find a basket or something. Look at this set, isn't it so dreamy? This mug is cute too. And it has a decent size as well. Oh, look at this set, that's cute too. My great grandfather built a like a little doll's house for my grandma in the 60s and that is still at my mom's house because she's currently trying to restore it for our son but let me quickly show you what i found here because this is very reminding of that doll house such a cool little thing look at the stairs someone really outdid themselves on this this one's definitely from the 60s and 70s too Look at that, I would definitely move into a house looking like that. That's such a good ground floor layout. I think I'm just gonna pick up a few random mugs because we're always out of mugs. So why not just go for it? They're all like a euro or two. So I feel like that'll be the best option. I'm back in the car. It is raining outside. I hope you can hear me. I was quickly thinking about showing you all the pieces that I got in this video, but the truth is I have thrifted a lot recently online as well. And so I think I'm just gonna do a collectible haul in like a week or so. So yeah, I wanna thank you for coming thrifting with me. I really hope you enjoyed it. I feel like this is a really random video, but as said, I just hope you enjoy these kind of random little rambly videos because I really like to make them. Uh, I had a lot of fun spending time with you today and I hope you did too. If you enjoyed this video, I would love it to give it a thumbs up and maybe even share it with a friend. It supports me, it supports the channel and it would truly mean the world. I hope you have a wonderful day. Go out, enjoy the sunshine, take yourself some time to focus on you and your mental health today and I will catch you in the next video. Bye everybody!